these two marks. Right. The marks on her backside, she says, are from her first and last session of black market butt injections. Because I found a deal. I thought I found the deal and went with that instead of looking more into it. The woman who doesn't want her face shown says she got the injections at this now abandoned Deep Ellum shop, the same location where a 34-year-old woman's abandoned body was found two weeks ago. Her cause of death is still pending. This woman was told she needed four sessions at $2,000 each. She saved up and paid $8,000, which she says was demanded up front in cash. Did that raise a red flag with you? It did. It did, but I was just like, in this state of mind, who cares? I got it. I'm just going to go do it. The woman who gave the injection, she says, was a lady the staff called Dr. W, or sometimes Wee Wee. The thing that I had was her Facebook, and that's how I actually contacted her, was through her Facebook, and it was so, like, she was so professional. She says on the day of her procedure, they gave her pills to relax. She had two friends with her who watched it all, and it was her friends who ended up yelling at Dr. W to stop midway through it. It was like I was bleeding too much, like the stuff was coming back out, and I just was like, stop. Like, she's not aware of what's going on, just stop. You don't remember anything? Now, she says her sides are misshaped, and she has a hard nodule on one side. She's now consulting with Dr. Bill Johnson. Are women risking their lives? When they're they're definitely risking their lives. Dr. Johnson says it's likely the silicone injection she got was silicone caulk, something sold at hardware stores. He's seeing more and more women come in for consultations to correct so-called back room butt injections. It's not enforced very stringently by law enforcement because it's not historically been a big problem, but this is a growing problem that needs to be more aggressively addressed. The woman now shudders to think how much worse things could have gone since the Deep Ellum woman was highly recommended. I know so many people who have went to her that is okay.